Question 1. What is meant by managed properties? Answer. We can't customize managed solution components. By using managed properties of managed solutions users can customize these managed solution components. Question 2. What are the different types of solutions in Dynamics CRM? Answer. There are two types Dynamics CRM solutions managed, unmanaged. We have default solution also in CRM with all components of instance. Question 3. Can we export default solution as managed solution? Answer. No. We cannot export default solution as managed solution. Question 4. What is managed solution? Answer. Managed solutions is a kind of completed package that we can distribute to others to install in their CRM organizations. Question 5. What is unmanaged solution? Answer. Unmanaged solutions is a group of unmanaged customization. Any unmanaged customized solution component can be associated with any number of unmanaged solutions. We can export an unmanaged solution as managed solution. We can't roll back the customizations once import into CRM instance. Question 6. Can we update the components in managed solution? Answer. No. We can't update the components in managed solution. Question 7. How can we know the owner of managed solution? Answer. Each managed solution is linked with publisher. Publisher indicates the owner of the managed solution who developed it. Question 8. What is the difference between remove and delete buttons on solution? Answer. Remove button release the components from the solution whereas delete button removes the component from CRM system. Question 9. What are all the steps to create a solution? Answer. Navigate to Settings, Solutions click on New Fill the required fields like Name, Version. Select the Publisher record, Create if not existed. Question 10. What are all the steps to export the solution as Managed Solution? Answer. Navigate to Settings, Solutions select the solution that you want to export click on Export, follow the wizard and select Managed Solution Type in Package Type Page. Follow the remaining steps in wizard and save the solution. Question 11. I am using singleton pattern and found that two objects are created. How is it possible? Answer. If you have multiple worker processes configured then not all of the requests are handled by the same process and thus not the same singleton. So if multiple singleton are handling requests then obviously multiple objects will be created. Question 12. Suppose if I have 20 user license and I have created 20 users. What will happen if I create 21st user? Answer. The 21st user will get created in MSCRM but that user will be in disabled state. Question 13. Can we modify the name of root business unit? Answer. No. We will have to reinstall MSCRM. Question 14. How to join two table using query expression? Answer. Using linked entity. You should always try to minimize the number of SWS calls that we make in the database. Often during code review it is explored that the number of Microsoft CRM web service could have been reduced by making use of the linked entity concept. So we should always look for the opportunity to minimize the effort. Question 15. What is append and append to privilege in MSCRM? Give one example of it. Answer. Append and append to privileges works together. Append to privilege will allow other entities to get attached with the entity. Append privilege will allow the entity to attach the records to the entity with append to privilege. Question 16. What is plugin? Answer. A plugin is an custom business logic which functions for integrating Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2011 with Microsoft Dynamics CRM Online. This integrating is to augment or modify the standard behavior of the platform. Question 17. What is workflow? Answer. Workflow involves the automation of business processes from one party to another whose actions are in accordance to a set of rules. Question 18. What is the difference between plugin and workflow with regard to security restrictions? Answer. The user requires an system admin or system customizer security role and membership in the development administrator group in order to register a plugin with platform, whereas the user can use the web application for workflow. Question 19. What is email router in Microsoft Dynamics CRM? Answer. Email router in MSCRM forms the software component which creates an interface between the organization's messaging system and the Microsoft Dynamics CRM deployment. 
Question 20. What is meant by metadata services of MSCRM? Answer. The metadata of MSCRM holds the information about the attribute and the entity. For instance, platform name, data type of attribute, size of the attribute, display name, etc.